Our house got demolished three years ago. I was asked where I wanted my RTP house to be built, and I indicated to the municipality. The tractors came and demolished part of what was my existing house in order to build the new one. I go to community meetings, and I keep asking the ward councillor for help. I even asked for temporary housing, like the ones given to the victims of the 2008 tornado. How can we not get sick in this house? It was better living in the house that got demolished. Nozi Pohenene lives in this house with her husband and grandson. She believes that these conditions are not adequate to raise a child in. The family survives on a child care grant and money Nozipo receives from doing odd jobs in the community. And this is Apiwe. He is in grade one at the Methodist school and wants to grow up to be a soldier. Many young people in this community are frustrated by their everyday conditions and turn to crime and substance abuse. No Zipo wants to change these conditions for Apiwe. She is very encouraging of Apiwe's dream to become a soldier. I only want what is best for him. I want him to stay in school. His mother was in grade 11 when she left school, and now she works. I don't even know where, but I am going to raise up here with God giving me the strength to do so. Only